So I want to say when I was younger, um, I had always known about Jesus. Um, had been to church. I had you know, gone down that road. It wasn't until 2014 I was baptized. Uh, I always thought there was a preconceived notion that it had to be perfect in my mind. But it wasn't until I went through a, a turmoil in my life and realized that it didn't need to be perfect. Um, God had come to me in a very powerful way. And, you know, I just wanted everybody to know um, about my you know, love for God and, and wanted to outwardly express that. So when I was baptized, it wasn't in a, you know, a river or in what I wanted to be was the, the ocean. The ocean was my solid, you know, my solitude and that's where I ultimately wanted to be baptized, but it just wasn't going to take place. So uh, I was baptized by Pastor Paul up at Liberty Christian Church in Cottonwood and it was in a horse trough. What, you know, unbelievable as that is, we, you know, we do horse trough uh, baptisms, but, um, you know, I had really prayed about baptism and, you know, you know, I was going to give my life over to Christ. So once I, I, I took a step into that trough, my heart was ready. And when I was uh, dunked by Pastor Paul, it was, it was like everything melted away. The, the heavens opened up and it, such a surreal experience took place. And um, the, you can just see this, this ray of light. Uh, through the water and on the other side was God and his love and it was just the you know a, a, a warm experience that I just couldn't get away from for the next few hours just the ultimate love that I was experiencing and just an awe so and one of the you know reasons that I believe you know believers that, that come to find Jesus should be baptized is it's an outward expression it holds you accountable to, to follow Christ, um, to always be searching for him. Um, it, it's just so that everybody can know um, that you're now a Christian, that you, you believe in, in Jesus and his way of life and, and following him. And now you have you know, the, the promise of eternal life so that you can share that with others. So when you get baptized it, and you've decided to follow Christ, your life is going to be turned upside down. You may have experienced uh, a life that, of just easiness. And now that you've followed Christ, you may experience something that might look a little harder. In the end, you'll notice that God is there with you through every inch of your life. Every, every storm, every um, situation that you're having to deal with something, that struggle, you're always going to make it through. Um, and even um, after you're baptized, you may even experience um, the Holy Spirit, you know, talking to you more. It's not something to be scared of. It's, it's something to embrace. It's just a, a beautiful experience after baptism where your heart is now centered. Uh, and there's no other experience better than the love that you feel from Christ after baptism.